So I finally got my hands on a pair of Beats Fit Pro earbuds. I'm of course gonna try them out and give you the lowdown, but the main thing I'm gonna focus on is whether the Beats Fit Pro stay put, because I'm sick and tired of my current earbuds, the Apple AirPods Pro, falling out of my ears. So I'm gonna try them out and see how I get on with them. If you've watched some of my other videos on earbuds, you will know that for me, Finding the right earbuds for working out isn't always as simple as picking up the first pair that I'd like the look of. They have to perform well in the situations that I'm going to be in when I wear them, otherwise they're useless to me. These Beats Fit Pro will be mainly used for the gym, so I need them to have noise cancelling that actually works well, to not fall out of my ears whatever I'm doing, and to also not run out of battery halfway through my workout. My current workout earbuds are the Apple Airbuds Pro. These are great at giving me nice, clear sound quality. I also like the noise cancelling feature, which helps to drown out some of the noises of the other people and the other things happening around the gym when I'm trying to focus on my workout. No other earbuds that I've tried have been as good at drowning out outside noises without me having to turn the volume all the way up to a ridiculous level, which of course would be harmful to my ears over time. Now, the problem with these is that they sometimes fall out of my ears when I do certain things, such as when I lay horizontally during bench presses, or if I'm laid out flat doing stretches or something of that nature. To say the least, it gets annoying, having to constantly pick them up and adjust them. So, I'm looking for earbuds that offer me the sound quality that I currently have with the AirPods Pro, and to combine them with the ability to actually stay put when I do things like bench, skipping, stretching, whatever it may be. In steps the Beats Fit Pro. I actually reviewed the previous earbuds from Beats. They were called the Beats Studio. And to be honest, they were a bit of a letdown. I'll put a link in the description so you can see that video after this one. My main gripe about the Studio Pros was that the noise cancelling on them just wasn't anywhere near the level as the AirPods Pros. So I'm really excited to see what the noise cancelling on these Beats Fit Pro will be like. The first thing you'll probably notice about the Beats Fit Pro is the price. At the time of making this video, they are nearly double the price of the Beats Studio Pros, which could mean that they are for higher quality and they have features that work better, or that possibly they've gone back and fixed some of the little annoyances that made the Beats Studio a bit of a letdown. Let's see. Now, let's look at the features that actually matter to me. The main features that I care about is whether they fall out of my ears when I'm working out, and I'll tell you how they fared a little later on. So the main features that set these apart from other earbuds in the same category are the sweat proof and water resistance. They will resist a little bit of sweat and a little bit of water. So if you're a heavy sweater during your workout or if you work out in light rain, it shouldn't affect the functionality of these earbuds. Active noise cancelling to block out outside noises and the flexible wingtips to give you more of a secure fit and of course stop them from falling out. There are of course other features such as spatial audio and a battery life offering you six hours of listening time and the case acting as a charger also. Normally when earbuds of this type have a case, it's normally a charging case as well. So I expected that from these sorts of earbuds anyway. Now when it came to working out with them, the Beats Fit Pro offer similar noise cancelling to the Apple AirPods Pro. To be fair, these did a pretty good job of cancelling out the outside sounds around me. It wasn't so strong that I wasn't able to hear anything else. Someone shouting in the distance could still be heard, but I'd say 70% of the sound around me was canceled out, which is pretty effective. I felt like I was in my own little sound bubble and nobody could distract me. Now the sweat proof and water resistant ability. I do tend to get really sweaty when I train, cardio days and leg days especially. My head does get a little sweaty when I work out, but not so sweaty that my headphones will be drenched and the sound will cut out. But however, when I did sweat, I didn't notice any difference in the operation of these earbuds. How did the battery battery hold up. The battery held up fine. In three weeks I only had to charge them maybe three times and they never completely fully lost their charge, which is really good. The thing is, when it comes to reviewing things that run off batteries, is that batteries over the years do lose their strength, but I can say over the three weeks that I used these, the battery held up brilliantly. Now, did they fall out of my ears? Now, the burning question for me is whether they fell out of my ears or not. And the answer is no, they didn't fall out of my ears once, which is very impressive. Working out with these was interesting. I did everything I normally do, skipping workouts, bench press, stretching, Olympic ring work, and I didn't have to adjust them at all. Once they were in, they were in. Very impressed. That's a big improvement from the Studio Pros that I reviewed earlier. Now there were a couple of minor annoyances with these. The only couple of minor annoyances that I would note is that like the Studio Pros before them, it's very easy to accidentally press the button on them and pause your music. But this wasn't really much of a deal breaker for me because they did everything else really well. If I've helped you in any way, please leave a like on this video. That was my review of the Beats Fit Pro earbuds. Definitely an improvement on the previous pair with a little minor annoyance that wasn't really a deal breaker for me. So thank you for watching my review and I'll see you in the next one.